Hello and welcome to the Shootcast. This is welcome to our USL Week One um, Team Builder versus the High World Dracos and Coach Alex. Um, we are current. We are z starting league. Um, um, so starting off, we have or starting off, Alex has Z Victini. Silvali, Umbreon, Empoleon, Slurpuff, Steelix, Mega Venu, Hydreigon, Galvantula, Electros, and Palm. Um, so, leading off, or starting off, I wanted to build around the Trick Room Mega Camel idea this week. Because, looking at Alex's team, Mega Camel comes in under Trick Room and gets a kill. Basically every time. So, starting off we have a Sash... Espeon for lead, if he brings Galvantula, we leave no, Espeon and make sure webs don't get up. Psychic, Dazzling Gleam, Trick Room, and Baton Pass. Now, this, I really want this to work because I really need this to get rid of Galvantula for me. So if webs don't get up on my side, that is very good for me. Um... Got Trick Room just in case if I want to, like, a couple things I've, um, in testing, coming in on Hidden Dragon, or like, um, coming in on a Switch, or like, something dies, I bring in Espeon on High Dragon, Trick Room, then Dazzling Boom basically. So, um, basically, the Sash is very helpful this game. And making sure that I can get up one trick room and then go into Mega Camel is very helpful. Because then I get basically three kills with Mega Camel. So, then moving on, we have a Raikou, for, and this is for Special Victini. Um, extra Sensory, Calm Mind, Rest, and Thunderbolt. This actually does a lot of work once um, Electros and Hydreigon are gone, and so is Steelix, but um, maybe even Ambipom too, but I can calm mind with stuff like Umbreon without Toxic, uh, and just overall stuff like that, and hopefully sweep, it'd be good to be able to sweep like that, so this is why I have Raikou, um, my answer to special Victini, and able to do a ton of damage to his team outside of Steelix and Hydreigon, basically. Uh, next up, we have our Dragonite Mizuchi, uh, Dragon Claw, Dragon Dance, Flying Earthquake, because it hits the majority of his team. After plus one, Z Fly kills Mega Venu. That's not really a problem. The only really thing I can see a problem with Dragonite is a Sash Slurpuff, perhaps, or like Scarf and the palm with ice punch just overall stuff like that like scarf mons and like sash mons are going to be very difficult for dragonite to break so hopefully i can get like rocks up and be able to see what his scarfers are and see how i can deal with that so next up we have our mega camel it's regulator um rocking earth power fire blast stealth rocks and h with ice we only really need earth power fire blast and h with ice not really even HP Ice, um, because Fire Blast to Hydreigon does like 40%! It's insane! But, um, that's just in case we need to deal a bunch of damage to Hydreigon. This thing comes in on a Trick Room, claims a bunch of kills, and then, um, basically, it cleans up stuff for, like, GD Dragonite, Calm Mind, Raikou, and, um, my Bahiam, so... Um, even though camera might not sweep this game, it will get kills this game, I know. So, next up we have our Bahiam Alienware with a Pattaya Berry to increase the special attack once it gets one foot or lower. Trick Room, Psychic, Signal Beam, and Shadow Ball. So, let's say... Mm, Empoleon, let's say Empoleon or something. Um, Yeah, so what? Or bad, kind of bad example. Let's say Electros gets us down to one fourth and we trick room. We have a plus one psychic that is getting after that Electros's ass. So 
that is actually very good for us because if he gets one fourth, we're basically nuking anything on his team. We have Signal Beam for his Dark types, Psychic for overall stab, and then Shadow Ball for the team. So that's Behem really. Uh, I want this to do a ton of damage for a later game. And then lastly, we have an Acid Armor Wakanberry Jellicent. This is my answer to Physical Victini. This is the way I deal with Physical Victini. I come in on any kind of Physical Victini, take it, hit with Wakanberry. Basically, just Acid Armor up. His main answer is Empoleon, Will O Wisp, Hex that. If he has Toxic, I have Rest. Basically, this is what Jellicent is for. Wearing down stuff like Victini and a lot of his walls. So, quick team builder, I know. Um, I'm predicting him to bring. Uh. One, two. This is kind of what I'm expecting. It could kind of bring anything in his team on his team, but this is probably what he is bringing, in my opinion. All week to make a camel, so that's going to be fun. So that's going to be our team builder. Hello and welcome to the two cast of Sarto. Welcome to our USL Week One battle versus the Hyrule Dracos and Coach Alex. Um. So he brought Victini, Mega Venusaur, Hydreigon, Umbreon, Savali, and Galvantula. So he brought Galvantula, so I'm leading Espeon. That's simple as that. Because I need to prevent webs from going up on my side of the field. Even though they'd help in Trick Room, I'd like to keep them up. So. Do I see if he's scarfed? Hmm. Hmm. I believe he would be scarfed. No, oh, I'm wrong. I, I, hmm. Dazzling Steam Gleam still Oko's though. He's not Scarf, there goes Hydreigon, turn one. So Trick Rooming there would have been a bad idea. <laughs> that would have been such a bad idea. Sylvans. Um, so while he fight! <laughs> uh, Psychic does up to like 50%. So U turns. I get my Trick Room up. I get my trick room up now, so whatever he goes in, he, he might go into Victini. He does go into Victini. If he's scarfed, we'll go before him. If he's not scarfed, we'll go after him. He is scarfed. I'm gonna just go into camel anyway. And it goes for psychic. Okay. So he is a special Victini. That is good to know. Good to know that he is of the special kind. Camera up. Um, sir, what are your switchings to make a camel? So this Mega Camel King, I think Mega Camel might get two kills here. I have Victini to prevent uh webs from going up. Or no, I have Espeon to prevent webs from going up. I know he's special Victini, so that was good for me for my CM Raikou. 
Oh, yo, it's nice to see but I cool. Mm. Um, I think you guys should just stack Victini and then go into, like, Galvantula or something. Victini is gone, turn four. Victini is gone, turn four. Good shit, Mega Camel. Good shit. Good shit, my dude. <laughs> Good shit, my dude. Good shit, my dude. Uh. So. Michael Mega Vino. Which I'm overall fine with it. He goes into Umbreon. What did Umbreon do to me? Spell play does up to like 30%. I might just go into Raikou. I feel like Raikou is a fine switch. Fine, switching. Um, because I have rest and all that. Cause I believe he will toxic here. I could just go into Espeon. I could go into Espeon basically, toxic him, which would toxic me. My overthinking this. <laughs> um, I could go Espeon. I could deal the straight, like, 50% that Fire Blast does to Umbreon. Which I think might be a good idea. And that's for Death Umbreon. If it's not for Death. That was definitely for death on the ground. And we live another. We live in those! We live in those! Um, I kinda wanna preserve Mega Camel because it could get another kill or two. And I know it's going for foul play. I know he is for death as well. I could set up rocks and then basically make it to Dragonite wins now with the combination of Z Fly and all that. I could just go into Raikou. Um, mm -hmm. has Fire Savali. I know that. Alright, do I want to say Mega Camel? I'm going to trust my gut and go into Raikou here. Basically, bait him to switch out thinking I have Aura Sphere. I gotta bait him into thinking I have Horus Sphere. Right? Hmm. So I can call Mind here. And then the only thing out after I just keep calming up, calm minding up is the only thing that can really beat me is Fire Savali. Which multi attack does like half, so I think I'm fine. Once I can get like to plus two, I can just outright win with Raikou. Um, 
This leads me to believe he doesn't have toxic since he could have toxic mega camel. I guess he didn't toxic fearing the Espeon to come in. And none of my testing matches, none of them brought Galvantula. That's interesting. Who goes into Venusaur? Extra sensory should be doing about half. That is not. Raikou, really? Really, Raikou? You have to do that. You had to do that. He does go into Silvali, which takes that much. Thunderbolt knocks out. I think Raikou just won. He goes into Yao. Which I don't know how it can do to me. Bug Buzz, that does not do enough. I do. Not enough, my dude! He, he goes Umbreon here, right? Yeah. But he's taken like 30 from people. And he gets parried, synchronized. I don't do I can't get parried. Oh my god, so sorry, my god. So sorry, my guy. Ugh. He wishes. Um, he does not protect. Alright, that's fine. I'll just call mine up. Because now at plus two, I am doing 40%. You left. You left. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, bro. Bro? 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 My dude? Bro? Well, maybe Camel got a kill, so... I'm happy about that. Hmm... Um, I guess while I wait, I'll just watch or no, replays and shit. Ooh, an OU game posted by Kibla. Kibla running rain in OU. Of course, that's an H. Where the hell did Alex go? Bro? Bro? Um, I guess I'll continue this if he ever comes back. So... 
If you don't see anything after this, that means I've won, probably 6-0. So, I'll see you next time, I guess? I don't know. Um, if he comes back, I'll re-record. So, if he comes back, I'll see you later. If not, um, goodbye. I'll see you in the next week, I guess. Alright, so, um, we're back. I waited about... Three minutes, or right after the recording ended, I asked the admins about what I should do. They told me wait five minutes, or I think that there was more like ten minutes or so. Um, so after ten minutes, Alex still didn't come back, and I've been awarded the win. Pretty sure it's a six-zero. And I'm pretty sure Raikou gets the last two kills. So, that's going to be our USL Week 1 battle. Um, with this video, I tried out a new thing where I combine the team builder and the battle. Tell me if you like that. Um, because I might do that with this battle and team builder on the same video, and then WCBL might split it into two. Uh, let me know if you want it like that. And. That's going to be it. Comment and subscribe really helps out the channel. If you want to see more? No? Better luck. And your Jacksonville Jill Towns are now 1 0.